Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. It's XOXO Evie here on, uh, what is it, Thursday, February 2nd. Just wanted to pop in and tell you hello. Um, I compiled a video with many clips, so like many videos into one video. Um, I'm still learning how to edit and record and do all those things, so thank you for being patient. <laughs> I know my videos aren't the greatest quality, but um, if you're here again, thank you for returning. If you're new, welcome. Please like, share, comment, subscribe to my channel. And so today, um, I just wanted to brief you up on a few things. Um, I, like I said, I recorded some videos, um, but I didn't do an intro. So this is my intro. <laughs> and then um, I'm going to put in, you know, the next videos over the past uh, couple, like, week or two that I've been recording into the um, video. I'm going to insert the, the videos into this video, if that makes sense. Oh my God, I'm repeating myself. Sorry. <laughs> so anyway, I just wanted to close off this video today, finally, um, by trying on the rest of my clothes that I bought on Sheen. And um, I don't know if I told you, I think I did, or I believe I did about uh, the pants that didn't fit. Um, so I'm not going to be trying those on. I apologize. I know you guys wanted to see them. I wanted to see them. Like, you know, I wanted to show them to you. But there's just no way that they're going to even zip up. Or, I mean, button up. So I'm going to spare you from having to see that. Okay. Now, I am going to have to give those. I'm not going to return them because they were on clearance uh, from Torrid. So I don't think I can. So, which is fine because I didn't pay that much for them and I'm just going to end up giving them to my mother-in-law and I know she, she'll fit into them and she'll like them. So I'm excited about that. But anyway, so now, um, I just want to let you watch the rest of the video and then I'll pop back in with some shirts that I'm trying on. All right. So I hope you guys enjoy and don't forget to, you know, comment, like, please subscribe if you haven't already. All right. So let me go ahead and show you the rest of the video. Hey guys, I'm at work. I just want to show you my quick outfit of the day. This is the purple sweater I bought from Torrid in an 1820. And these are the jogger pants that I bought also in an 1820. And this is what they look like. Hey guys, good morning. It's another day here at work and I'm here early to do my morning routine. I thought I'd show you guys, uh, you know, how I do my eyebrows in the morning. And then I showed you guys last time that I do the dry shampoo, I'll do that again. And then I just wanted to show you, this is the knit sweater from Sheen that I got in 1820. So it's really comfortable, um, goes down, you know, pretty far, covers the belly very warm. I have a black v-neck t-shirt underneath just because um, the knit is uh, like an open knit kind of. You can't really tell but trust me up close you can you can see skin so definitely want to cover that up. Anyway so let's get to the eyebrows I guess first um, and if anybody walks in you guys sorry it's Try to get here early so that nobody's here, but sometimes we have some early birds like me. So I just want to show you real quick what I'm going to do with the eyebrows. And I just kind of go over with the eyebrows that I had yesterday uh, just to keep the shape. Let me do this and I'll be right back. All right, guys. So this is the best I could do with the eyebrows, and sure enough, somebody walked in. So I'm glad I paused it. Anyway, um, let me show you this real quick. Now, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I cut the shit out of my hair. It's like really short. Um, I will be dyeing it this weekend, so I will uh, update you with that. But yeah, I look like Lord Farquaad right now. <laughs> Not cute. So I can't wait to get that like, you know, evened out because I, yeah, I didn't do a good job. And then now you're telling me why did you cut your own hair? Because I wanted. 
wanted to. Oh, and I just lost an earring. Oh no. Um, I'm gonna have to look for it. Don't know where that went. Oh man, my cute little earring. Oh, oh, I felt, oh, it's in my shirt. <laughs> Where'd it go? Come here, buddy. Hold on. <laughs> oh my goodness, are you guys? Oh, all right, I'm pretty sure I felt it. starts getting to work. I just want to show you my outfit of the day. This is that green heather blouse or shirt that I told you I got from Torrid. No, this is from Sheen. So I just wanted to show you. It's the 1820 and I'm wearing it with my black velvet pants that I love. Just wanted to show you. It's a pretty good shirt, right? And it fits really well. It's super comfortable, breathable. I love it. <sighs> anyway, <laughs> I like to come to work early and take my time doing things. Um, it's just my morning routine. It kind of gets me ready for the day, mentally prepared, if that makes sense. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to show you uh, my blouse real quick, and I hope that you guys have a wonderful day. Uh. Hey guys, uh, just bringing you a quick video. We're on our way to the casino, the Chumash Casino, and I just wanted to show you the nice view. Uh, it's kind of cloudy today, um, but the sun is breaking through in some spots, and I'm we're, we're getting close to where the lake is, Lake Kachuma, and I want to see how full it is, especially after the rain. Um, I know when it started raining, it was like at 31%, and I believe now it's spilling over, so I can't wait to see that. It always makes me happy when I know there's water in the lake. So, let's see if we can see anything. But yeah, it's always a nice drive, you guys. We love coming here on the weekends. Um, it's only about a 40 minute drive, maybe? From uh, down from town up to the hills in here, uh, setting as mountains, and we just saw a helicopter hovering above us. 
probably taking a look at the lake. Ooh, it's sprinkling. Alrighty. We can always use some water, especially around here. In Southern California, it's so dry, we need it. And here's this um, huge bridge that we like to go over. It's really um, high up and it's kind of scary, but it's pretty cool. covered it but you'll be able to see the water in just there we go there we go that's looking real good that's the way we like Kachuma with water We made it to the casino. We're going to the park. And then I will talk to you guys again. We're just pulling up here. Let's. I wonder if it's busy today. Last time we came, it was like super packed. And I think it was like the day after New Year's or something. I forget. And it was just like packed. Self parking right here. Yep. Alrighty, guys. Alright, guys, we're walking to the casino now. It's kind of chilly, but here, I just want to show you my outfit real quick. Here, babe, can you film? Hey, guys, so yeah, cut my hair shorter, dye it red. I haven't really done much to it today, but I just want to show you my outfit. This is my jacket that I bought at Torrid. It's a size. Five, but I need it. I like to wear room. This is the green top that I bought from um, Sheen, and these are my um, black pants from Torrent. They're um, my joggers. All right, sorry. Let's go. <laughs> Somebody was staring at me in the car. It's like, oh shit. All right, now we're in the elevator on our way up to go play some casino games. Everyone, this is Victor. Say hi. <laughs> All right, let's see you in the casino. All right, guys, wish me luck. <laughs> let's see here. <sighs> How many credits? Let's do that.
guys, I'm gonna keep playing and I'll be right back. Right, I just won 40 bucks. Um, so I won about 50 bucks and I changed machines. Now I'm at this one and we'll see how it goes. real quick it takes me a minute to like know what shape to do so that's why I pause it when I do it anyway um so yeah I'm wearing my red top that I love um, and as you guys can see from the other videos that I posted um, I dyed my hair red and cut it very short um, I actually got it done by a friend so um, you know it's it's looking a little better. Now I haven't washed it in like two days. So today is hair washing day. So um, I'll show you guys a video of how I style it. All right. But anyway, yeah. So I just come in the mornings, you know, my routine, do my eyebrows, do my hair. And I like getting here early. It just kind of sets the tone for the day for me. You know what I mean? Like I get a feel for the, for the day. Um, yeah, and that's about it. I will be back with more videos um, soon. This is just real quick, just showing you the tops that I bought. Oh yeah, and I'm wearing a new bra from Torrid. <laughs> I love it. All right guys, have a good day. Hey guys, all right, so I'm at my desk and I was just thinking, I don't think I showed you guys the video of me trying on the pants um, because that file got corrupted on my camera at home, so I wasn't able to upload it. But um, I just wanted to let you guys know a little bit about what the pants looked on looked like on me. Um, they did not fit. <laughs> they were a little tight. Um, they so one of the pants had button like a button fly um, and I was only able to button like two buttons so I decided you know what I'll give these to my mother-in-law um, but um, so yeah so sorry if I didn't show you the pants they didn't work out I'm so sorry the, the video that I had got corrupted and I'm not able to even play it back so uh, if I ever get that video I'll let you guys know but I doubt it um, anyway, so yeah, I just wanted to wish you guys a good day and I'll talk to you again real soon. Hey guys. All right. So today is hair washing day where let's go wash this mop <laughs> and then we are going to dry it straight. Anyway, I hope you guys like my new hair color. I love it. By the way, my friend did it. And, um, although I did formulate the color, she is the one who applied it, so um, props to her. She did a really good job. What's up, Helda and Anna? Hi. <laughs> anyway, um, so let's go wash this, all right? All right, guys, I'm back. Just washed my hair. Um, now, so basically what I do is once I wash it, I leave it in my towel for a little bit just so that it dries up a little more, you know? 
um, the towel soaks up the water and then I kind of let it dry naturally for about 10 to 15 minutes. Um, just so that it's not like dripping wet. It's just like, you know, damp, still wet, but not like, you know, the water just still dripping off. Um, cause otherwise that would take forever for my hair to dry. Um, and it would just take a lot more, um, heat, you know, because I would have to dry it longer. So I don't want to expose it to the heat too long. Cause then that's when you get split ends. That's when you get frizzy hair. And I'm trying to, to, um, keep the integrity of my hair. Now I, I pride myself in keeping my hair healthy. Um, so I didn't dye it for a very long time for almost like 10 years, I would say, um, just because I know how damaging hair dye can be especially if you do it often. Um, and then because of the color that I usually wear, which is like a red burgundy kind of color, um, it has to lighten my hair. So a lot of that lightening, uh, you know, in the, in the developer, it can cause damage to my hair, especially because my hair is so fine and delicate. So I try to keep as much as I can of my hair on my head. <laughs> you know what I mean? But anyway, let's go ahead and dry this up a little bit, air dry. I'm going to put some product in it and then we're going to dry it. All right. Okay. So my hair's down, it's wet. Um, but you can see the, the redness in it. You know what I mean? Like, uh, right now the lighting in here sucks. So I do apologize, but let's go ahead and put some product in it. Okay. One of the first things that I put in it and I love this stuff. I've been using it for years and you can use it alone. Like you don't have to put any, you, this is what I use as my detangler. A moisturizer. I use it for everything. I can use this alone. I don't have to put anything else in my hair. But because I am straightening it now with a hair dryer, I do need a little bit more protection. So that's where I have these two other products that I'm going to show you. But so for this, this is the um, Cream of Nature Argan Oil from Morocco Strength Shine and Leave-In Conditioner. I've been using this for years and I love it. Now you got to shake it up because it kind of like separates. There's like a cream and then like a liquid. So you got to shake it up and put my glasses down here. And then I just spray it in my hair, you know, just kind of go upside down, spray it all around. And it smells really good too. So then I grab my paddle brush and then I just kind of distribute it while I detangle. Okay. Now, the second product that I like to put in here, and I'm not putting any more oil in it like the other oil that I had because um, I was using that when my hair was really dry. But because I cut off all the dry parts, like I don't really need it anymore. You know what I mean? So instead of that, I'm using the Chi... Keratin Catrix 5 Thermal Active Smoothing Treatment. And this really comes in handy if you're blow drying your hair, styling it with heating tools, anything. Um, this is just to give it that extra protection. And the keratin in it, you know, reinforces the hair. And it also helps it to maintain, um, you know, like when you straighten it, it helps keep that style. So let's put some in. And it smells so divine. It smells so good. So, so we're going to put that in there. You don't have to use too much, you know, don't get crazy. Start off with a little bit. And if you need more, then add more. And we're going to brush it through again. I like to do this every time I, I put in the product just to make sure that it's evenly distributed. And all right. Um, now the last thing I put in my hair is called Verb Ghost Oil. If you guys have never tried this, I recommend it highly, highly recommend it. Um, I bought it at Ulta for like 20 bucks. You guys will not, uh, you guys will not be disappointed. Definitely. Okay. Now I'm not going to put this in my hair right now because I'm going to let my hair dry a little bit before I put this in. Otherwise it's just going to soak into my hair and not do anything. I think that's just, but I don't know if that's how it works. <laughs> anyway, so let me dry. Let me let this dry a little bit more naturally. And I'll come back and uh, 
blow dry it with you guys. All right. Thanks. Okay, guys. So, you know, it's dried up a little bit. Um, enough to where it's not like soaking wet, you know, I mean, it's still wet, but it'll, it'll be okay. So let's go ahead and section the hair. I'm going to start on the bottom. So there we go. Put a little hair clip in. And then start in the back. Now, um, the ghost oil I'm going to add on after I blow dry it so that it kind of smooths it and I don't get too oily, you know. So let's start off with my... And by the way, I, this Revlon, um, uh, like, I forget what it's called. What do you guys call it? Um, like a dryer wand? I don't know. I don't know what it's called, but I love it. And, um, it dries my hair like in 10 minutes. So I'm very happy I purchased this. Now it does get very hot. I did burn my thumb the other day, just like with the heat of the, like the steam, you know, and the heat, it was just like on my finger and it hurt really bad. So do be careful. This, do, this thing gets hot. Okay. It's not like one of those cheap little blow dryers that you barely get any air out of. No, this, this will dry your hair properly. Um, so yeah, so, which is good, you know, I need it to get hot and work for my texture. Um, anyway, so again, if you guys don't recall, this is the Revlon, um, air dryer. What do you call it? Air dryer Air. I don't know what it's called. You guys, the name just will not stay in my head, <laughs> but you know, you know what I'm talking about, right? Okay. Um, again, it's the Revlon one and it comes in three different settings, uh, high, low and cool. So let's go ahead and get started. All right. Ooh, it's hot. I'm telling you guys. So the first section is done. That's how, that's how fast it is. That is how fast it is. Now, wait, let me just give it another go on this side. So there you go. First, first section done. Now we're going to get the second section. And, you know, I like to section it because you get better control that way. Um, and you don't keep drying the same part over and over again, you know, and causing damage. Okay. Let's see here. Okay. Second section.
See the nice layers? I love it. And do the third section. Now for the third section I just take whatever is around the crown. I section off the crown and put that back up. And that'll be my final section. Okay. guys 
final section. Now with this final section, I'm still going to section it in half or, you know, in thirds, whatever you prefer, depending on how much density you have in your hair. So I'm just going to section it away. We're going to start with the top. So, last section. Or, actually, no, maybe not. <laughs> I'll do this one in half. Um, just to make sure that I'm evenly drying everything. I don't like to go back and then go, oh, I should have done this or I should have done that, you know. If you do it right the first time, you won't have to. So... It's dry. Now, that did not take hardly any time at all. You know what I mean? Uh, so, yeah. I hope you guys like it. <laughs> now, um, let's, excuse me, let's put in the uh, ghost oil. All you need is a tiny little pump like that, okay? Emulsify, emulsify, emulsify. <laughs> Once you got your hands ready to go you just take it and put it anywhere you want you know there we go i got some shine now <laughs> this poof eventually will <laughs> go down it just i just need the volume for now but eventually it'll it'll die down a little but yep there we go it's done and I love the color you guys like the balance the body I have it's just healthy and it feels good you know what I mean <sighs> so all right we're all set <laughs> I promise this will eventually settle down <laughs> anyway 
All right, guys. Thanks for watching my videos. Love you. Bye. Hey, guys. All right, so here are the last two remaining shirts from Sheen that I've yet to try on. Um, the purple one and my little polka dot one. So let's go ahead and try these on, shall we? All right, guys, so this is the purple top in a 2X, or no, 3X, um, which I believe is an 1820 in Sheen. I'm not, To be honest, I'm not sure, guys. I'm sorry, but oh, I forget the sizing. <laughs> but I know that the shirt says 3X. I believe the 3X um, in this shirt equals an 1820. But I could be wrong. Anyway, this is what it looks like. I hope you guys like it. I do. It's nice. It goes all the way down to the, you know, covers my backside. <laughs> and, you know, as far as the belly, it's not not too bad, you know. But anyway, uh, I'm excited to wear this to work. This is a nice work blouse. And I like it. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to try on the next one. All right, guys, so this is my polka dot one. I call it my, my I Love Lucy one. <laughs> and I love it. Look at that. It's the perfect length. Um, it's a nice little baby doll top. It's got cute little ruffly sleeves, you know, that gives it a little feminine touch. And the length is perfect. I don't need it to be any longer. Covers everything I need covered, including the belly. The only thing I would have a gripe about is that it's a little tight in the chest, but can't do anything about that. <laughs> so, but other than that, I like it. And I mean, it's not like super stretchy or anything, but it has like a little bit of give enough for the girls to fit in. But like I said, it's a little tight. Um, but anyway, I'm still going to wear it because I'm planning on losing more weight. So let's hope. Let's hope that it's not out of style by the time I lose it. <laughs> anyway, so that's it. I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this weird uh, video. <laughs> it's kind of like my little Frankenstein video. You know, I'm kind of like splicing it and putting videos in and changing them around. And I don't know what I'm doing yet, but I'm trying. <laughs> But anyway, um, I just wanted to tell you guys, you know, that I really do appreciate you um, coming to see my channel. I do this because I have fun. I don't do it, you know, for any other reason than that. Um, you know, I'm not like a regular YouTuber. I'm not a vlogger. I don't, I won't, I'm not the type of person that's going to have like vlogmas, you know, but I will upload randomly. And who knows, you know, um, maybe... I can start doing different videos and get new ideas and other things like that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, me trying on clothes, going to the casino with my husband and, you know, just talking to you guys. Uh, that's what I enjoy. So again, uh, if you're back, welcome back. If you're new, thank you for showing up saying, say hello, please, anytime. And if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, it's XOXO Evie, that's E V I, all one word, dot 805. Add me on Instagram. Let's be friends. Let's chat. All right. I look forward to meeting all of you, and I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of the week. I will see you soon. Ciao.